Let's talk about computer code. What do we mean when we say code? You might know this already, but let's just do a really quick review. Any piece of technology that uses a computer to control it has to have some type of a code that controls the computer, that controls the technology. The code is just the instructions. Now, there's all kinds of different computer code languages. In fact, if we Google computer code languages and go to Wikipedia, there's a list there of programming languages, and there's tons of them. Look at all the different types of languages. Think about the languages on the earth. You have French, you have German, Spanish, English, and so many other languages. Language for humans is a way of communicating. For a computer to communicate with a piece of technology, it also needs a language or a computer code. Let's look at the computer that I'm on right now. The browser is called Google Chrome. Google Chrome is actually a technology that allows us to surf the internet. Let's go to walmart.com. This website is also a technology that allows us to quickly search through the many different Walmart products. But this website technology needs information to create all the different images, links, and other functions. Do you want to see the code? All you have to do is right click on any area that is not a hyperlink or an image. Right click and view page source. And boom, there's all the code. Again, the code is the instructions for creating this website. Think about all the different technologies that you have around your house that use computers. Your microwave oven uses a computer and that computer is controlling the microwave with a code. Your dishwasher uses a computer and it controls how the dishes are washed using code. Your iPad, your iPhone, probably even your coffee maker or even your car. These all have electronic technologies that are controlled by computer code. What other technologies can you think of in your house that have computers that need a computer code?